Okay. Going back up forward here. I'll begin with questions. I'll start with Jacob Padilla. It seemed like you were pretty aggressive tonight, not just looking for your shot, but attacking and looking to make plays for others. What was your mindset coming into the game? What were you hoping to bring tonight? Uh, you know, just energy, you know, uh, every minute I get, you know, get out there and, and trying to make plays. And, and uh, I think tonight I, I, I got to uh, open a little, little more and, and I think I got a little more confident in the game. And so, yeah, I was just looking to, to create. Robin Lushett. So I know this season probably hasn't gone the way that you personally would have hoped, but uh, wh how did you manage to take advantage of your opportunity like you got today, uh, despite kind of the, the way this season's gone? And I guess, uh, how have you been able to maintain kind of your focus to be able to, I guess, like, like you said, take advantage of when, when you got that chance? I mean, I've been here for a long time and, and, and something that you learn is you, you got to always stay ready and no matter how much you play and no matter how wet one game you get in you know we always got to be ready and especially with this this season and how it's how it's gone you know we after COVID coming back we're playing day after day after day after day so you have always got to be ready you never know when your opportunity is going to come and I think you know that's my mindset is always you know you, you know I, I want to be on the court I can't be on the court and you know when I'm on the court I gotta I gotta show that I belong to be on the court. Connor Happer. Thor, coach said uh, you guys had a meeting um, at some point before the game. Just is that help your confidence? And where was that kind of at going into tonight? And, and how do you feel to have a performance like that? Uh, I mean, yeah, it definitely helped. You know, you know when when things are not going great, you know, you 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 sometimes uh, tend to tend to you know lose confidence a little bit. You, your mind kind of starts going somewhere. And I think it was just good that we we had a little talk and then we just talked about whatever, you know, and, and I think that's, you know, definitely helped me. And, and I think, you know, just seeing the ball go through the hoop tonight too as well was really good. And, and I think, you know, I just got to keep uh, building on that. And, and you know, we, we got to keep pu pu um, pushing forward as a team and, you know, got to get some, some wins. Sam McEwen. Thor, you, you said you said it. You, you've been here a long time. You've you've had so four distinctly different seasons since you've been here too. Huh? Have you guys even, because of the circumstances with COVID and all that, do do you even feel like this team is truly you know what it is yet and may not find out until this last stretch what you guys can really potentially be because of all the disruptions? Uh, yeah, that's definitely definitely a point. You know. Um... Like you said, with how the season has has gone, and I think, you know, some of it obviously has to do with the fans. You know, not having uh, packed PBA here, you know, cheering us on, and, and and you know, you guys know how how good the Husker Nation is. You know, coming to games no matter how it's going, and I think, you know, that is something. I mean, some of these guys don't even know how how it is. You know, coming coming to play here and in the Big Ten, and you know, every arena like like just a game day is so much different. I was thinking, you know. You think that before the game, you know, you come in, nobody there, you got to hype yourself up. But I think, you know, we showed stretches for sure where we can be really, really good. And I think, you know, you guys are probably tired of hearing about it because we, we we keep on saying that. But I really believe that, that this team can be really good. Chris Bastet. Hey, Thor, what do you what do you want to try and accomplish over these next three weeks? You know, personally, as a team, obviously, you said you want you want to win games and you, you want to be more successful. But just what, what would you like to see yourself accomplish? What would you like to see this team accomplish over these next few weeks? You know, just uh, staying together uh, is definitely what we have to do. You know, it's hard, but uh, we have to keep making strides to to get better. And, you know, there's always there always comes a point where you start thinking about you know the Big Ten tournament and that's obviously a huge thing and I think you know with last year how we went and it got all shut down and I think you know my sophomore year we got a good we, we went on a good run you know that you know never never know what happens in those kind of tournaments and I think building uh, you know obviously just more chemistry building a good momentum going into the Big Ten tournament is obviously something that I think is really important for this team and yeah, like I said before staying together. And we'll finish with Jacob Padilla. I had a lot of different guys kind of step up off the bench today, and you guys played well on both ends together. I know Shamil has kind of been coming on recently. Do you feel like kind of that second unit, you guys are starting to get a little chemistry, you're starting to get a little comfortable and how, how you guys need to play to make an impact? 
Yeah, I think, you know, that also just has to do with uh, practice. You know how we, we, we are a lot, we're on the same team a lot during practice, and, and we haven't had a lot of practice recently. So I think, you know, yesterday uh, we got a little run in. So I think that obviously helps. And, you know, it's like I said, just like with me and with the guys coming off the bench, you know, we always have to be ready. And I think tonight uh, we, we, they, they play good. And, and uh, yeah, you know, just sad that we didn't get the win because uh, we were in the game and, and we, we miss, we miss, I think, four or five wide open threes to keep it a game. And they always come down and score and, and we can't let that affect us. And I think, you know, they got too many easy baskets and, and uh, you know, it's, it's tough. Thank you, everybody. That will end today's press conference. Thank you for it. Thanks, guys.